Happy Tuesday, meteorologist Katya Hall. Another dry day in South Florida and across the Sunshine State, but then we'll start to see our rain chances tick up a little bit as this area of low pressure is situated over the Atlantic starts to push its way a little bit closer here. And as we head into about Thursday and Friday, that's when we'll start to see our rain chances on the increase. But again, future cast showing dry weather out there today. Lots of sunshine, a few passing clouds, only a slim chance for an isolated shower. Tomorrow, some East Coast showers possible with those breezy winds expected throughout the day. And then by Thursday, Friday, we start to increase those rain chances, especially across the eastern half of the peninsula, where we, we are expected to see the bulk of that rainfall. Afternoon temperatures today in the upper 70s to low 80s across the east coast. A little bit warmer, though, with that onshore flow across Tampa, Fort Myers. Afternoon temperatures in the upper 80s to low 90s. The good news is the humidity stays nice and low over the next few days, and then we start to increase that heat and humidity by the end of the work week and into the weekend. Overnight temperatures down in the 50s in Panama City, mid to upper 60s across Fort Lauderdale and Miami. For tomorrow, another pleasant day across the East Coast, but again, a bit on the warmer side with Tampa, Fort Myers reaching the upper 80s to low 90s. On Thursday, scattered showers and some thunderstorms possible, highs in the upper 70s and 80s. And then Friday, turning up that heat and humidity, temperatures once again climbing above normal.